United States Navy presents The Eddie Duchin Show. <laughs> Music for your listening pleasure. Transcribed by the magic fingers of radio, Eddie Duchin and his orchestra. And as our special guest, lovely radio singing star, B. Wayne. Today we salute the waves of the United States Navy. For the first time in history, women other than nurses are now a part of the regular Navy. Volunteering in a time of extreme emergency, waves released thousands of men for duty at sea. To the glorious traditions of our Navy, they brought a living spirit of their own. Their brilliant wartime service earned for them the right to wear the honored Navy blue. Their high sense of loyalty, exceptional spirit, and devotion to duty will serve the Navy well. Skipper Eddie Duchin splices the musical main brace with one from the back of the book, Sometimes I'm Happy. Look at here. I got a fan letter. Well, Ken Roberts, you've arrived. Blonde or brunette? Uh, what does she weigh? <clears throat> brunette, about uh, 185 pounds. <laughs> oh. It's from my kid brother. Oh, you had me stop for a minute. Say, what's he say? Well, he gets out of college this year, Eddie, and since I'm doing this Navy show, he was asking me about a Navy career. Well, I hope you told him about the NAVCADs, Ken. The what? The Naval Aviation Cadets. A swell spot for any guy who has had at least two years of college credits. Well, what's the deal, Eddie? Well, NAVCADs receive the world's best flight training at the Naval Air Station in Pensacola, Florida. Mm -hmm. That's the Annapolis of the air. And when they've earned their Navy wings of gold, they get a commission as a reserve officer in the Navy or Marine Corps. Then they spend two thrill-packed years on active duty with the fleet, flying latest type carrier planes or roaring across the ocean at the controls of a big flying boat. How's that for a young Joe just out of college? Pretty swell, Eddie. Men, if you're single, 18 to 25 years old, and with two years of college, find out more about a Navy career starting as a Naval Aviation Cadet. Just write to NAVCAD. That's N-A-V-C-A-D. NAVCAD. Washington 25, D.C. <laughs> Navy veteran Eddie Duchin plays. Navy veteran Tommy Mercer sings Ain't Doing Bad. Thank you. 
Ain't doing bad, doing nothing Just laying around all day I'm telling you the less I do The more things come my way When I get up in the morning Thinking of the day ahead Makes me so downright weary I go right back to my bed Why should I ever worry It's such a losing game Why should I move When I can prove I get there just the same Ain't doing bad, doing nothing Somehow it seems to pay Ain't doing bad, doing nothing Just laying around all day It's guest our time, and Eddie Duchin says hello to V. Wayne. Welcome aboard, V. Hi, Eddie. Gosh, what's all that pile of stuff you've got there? Oh, these? Mm -hmm. Why, all of my white gloves, of course. You know, I'm wise to this Navy business. White gloves? I don't get it. Well, for a white glove inspection, of course. Uh, I have 14 pairs. Shall I lay them out on the piano, <laughs> or would you... No, 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 V. A white glove inspection is when a commanding officer inspects his ship wearing white gloves. He runs a gloved finger along the overhead beams and everywhere. And if it gets dirty, he knows there's dust. Oh. Then you don't want to inspect my white gloves? <laughs> well, no. But we'd be glad to run a white glove over a chorus of One for My Baby. Glad to oblige, Skipper. <laughs> There's no one in the place except you and me. So set em up, Joe. I've got a little story you ought to know. We're drinking, my friend, to the end of a brief episode. Get one for my baby and one more for the rest. I got the routine, so drop another nickel in the machine. I'm feeling so bad, I wish you'd make the music. But, buddy, I'm a kind of poet, and I've got a lot of things to say. And 
when I'm gloomy, you simply gotta listen to me until it's tucked away. Well, that's how it goes. And Joe, I know you're getting anxious to close. So thanks for the cheer. I hope you didn't mind my bending your ear. This torch that I found must be drowned or it soon might explode. Make it one for my baby and one more for the road that long, long road. Thank you, B. Wayne. That was fine, but fine. This is Ken Roberts again with a message of particular interest to the young women of America. There's a career for you in the United States Navy. As a wave, you will take your place side by side with the men of the Navy for their special work for you in aviation, communications, and hospitals. Work that women can do and are doing now. Special Navy training will discover and develop your individual talents. As a part of the regular Navy, you will enjoy the same benefits as the men in Navy Blue, get the same pay, the same retirement benefits, the same medical and dental care. Here is your chance to join this small group of carefully selected young women. The waves have proved themselves by setting their own standard of efficiency and devotion to duty. Now is the time to join the ranks of the women in blue. Become a Navy wave. For information, see your local Navy recruiter or write to the Bureau of Naval Personnel, Navy Department, Washington 25, D.C. It's an Eddie Duchin special, the famous Duchin arrangement of the Jerome Kern song, Lovely to Look At. Time to haul up the gangway on another show. Thanks, B. Wayne, for visiting with us. Tommy Mercer, you did a swell job, and we'll fly a special E pendant for Eddie Duchin, who says, In every way, the Navy offers a fine career for women. Find out what it can mean to you to be a wave by checking with your local recruiting officer. And thanks for listening. And be sure to listen in again for the Eddie Duchin Show, transcribed and presented by the United States Navy. <laughs> <laughs>